and spot Bitcoin exchange traded fundraise picks pace as eight spot Bitcoin ETF issues filed updated S1 forms declaring authorized participants APs, fees, or other changes. Along with other filers, Grayscale also filed the written communication regarding APs after the U.S. SEC declared DE29 as the last date for issuers to update their spot Bitcoin ETF applications. Uh, Grayscale Bitcoin Trust submitted a free writing prospectus to the U.S. Uh, Securities and Exchange Commission on December 29 as other spot Bitcoin ETF issuers filed updated S1 forms and uh, the FWP mirrors a post on X by Grayscale CEO Michael Sonnenschein been in this game a long time we've had APs lined up uh, since 2017 uh, spot Bitcoin ETF issuers such as BlackRock, Fidelity, Valkyrie, Vanna, Bitwise, Invesco and Galaxy Wisdom Tree and Franklin Templeton submitted updated S1 filings announcing authorized participants or fees. Fidelity uh, Wise Origin Spot Bitcoin ETF has the lowest fee of 0.39%. Uh, Sonin Shine claims that Grayscale has been ready since 2017 with Jane Street and Virtue as authorized participants as per an SEC filing dated May 4th, 2017. Uh, Bloomberg uh, ETF Analyst James Seifert said, this is a great point from Son and Shane. He added that Grayscale was never an issuer. They were worried about getting an AP agreement. He expects more issuers will be getting to the starting gate. The window for spot Bitcoin ETF approval ranges between January 5th and 10, 2024. And while top ETF experts don't doubt Grayscale leading the spot Bitcoin ETF race as they adopt cash model for approval, Bloomberg senior ETF analyst Eric Balchunas warned that they must file S1 as per requirement and confirm their authorized participants. I'm sure they'll add soon, though.